What's going on everybody, it's Officer here, and welcome back to the Car Showcase video, and in today's video I'm going to be showing you guys the closest thing we can get to an unmarked Ford Taurus, basically a Ford Taurus that you could make, uh, not the one that includes in the game of course, it looks like it's a newer model, uh, this is the Ocelot Jackal for anybody who's out there wandering, it's a very durable vehicle, uh, this thing can handle very well off-road, it can handle very well on the snow, it can handle basically very well on any terrain that you have necessary. Uh, the only downside is this thing, the suspension is lower than many other vehicles, even though it may not seem like it, it actually has a lower suspension as this sedan, so I don't know why, uh, but it is a little bit bulkier, uh, which makes it very suitable, and I thought this would be a very good choice for a police car. So without further ado, let's just get into customizing this vehicle, and I hope you guys are having an amazing day. We're also hitting uh, 1,000 subscribers soon, so with that being said, let's get started into this vi vid video. Uh, okay, so first off, we're just going to repair it because we damaged it with the snow on the side. Uh, first off, armor. We don't ever mess with armor. Brakes. We just put on the custom front bumper because we just don't mess with brakes pretty much. Those are basically up to your choice. Now the front bumper, you can barely see the difference. Same for the rear. This one changes the exhaust and the back grille. So if you like this vehicle, you can. The engine, again, that's up to you. Uh, since this is on my alt account with the NPCs, I don't have anything unlocked. The exhaust, I always like to upgrade it to the max. Sometimes the stocks look better, other times the dual exhaust look better. Explosives we never deal with. And um, the hood is up to you. I personally want to leave it as a stock hood. Uh, but then again, if you want to go for the vent, I could see why. The horn, we obviously put the cop horn, like why wouldn't you? The lights, I'd keep them stock uh, because like those just look too much like a uh, modern police car, which is not what we're going for. The tracker is in case if you want to buy it, of course, because this is a street car you can find. Uh, obviously, put on the SA exempt plate since this is a government vehicle. Um, and basically, yeah, we're going to respray it, and this only has one respray as well as you can put your chrome on it. Uh, you can respray it to whatever color you want. In this case, I just basically decide, you know, I think black would be nice. Uh, but then I'll just show you all the other options that you could possibly have, and the chrome does stick out very well with this vehicle. Uh, so this thing doesn't sell for very much since it is a street car. If you want to put on the custom skirts, you're more than welcome to. They may hit the ground at times. Um, and the spoiler, uh, they don't really have very low lip spoilers, so I can't really say that spoilers are a very good option for you. Uh, but whatever, it, this is completely your car. Uh, customized, I'm just giving you a few guidelines. So if you want a spoiler like that, you can. Suspension, I wouldn't go any lower, nor transmission, unless you want to go from 0 to 60 very quickly. Turbo, we never mess with. And the wheels are the part where people always ask me, how do you do this? So... Since this account is on a lower level, uh, there are some wheels that there are, like for instance, these ones right here that actually would look very good if you painted them black. Uh, but there are some wheels, and I'm going to replace the wheels in cases if you're not a high enough level on your alt account, or if you just have like not enough money to buy it or something on your primary account. So basically, we're going to go into the sports section wheels over here, apparently, and uh, of course you can't put on a wheel color, which is what I'm trying to experiment with. So. We're going to go over to off-road wheels, and this is going to actually look very good on the snow, too. I put on the mudslinger wheels, and then we paint those things black. Sorry I misled you into the sports category. I don't know why I was thinking. I'm just commentating over this. I put on light smoke because not all cop cars are just transparent like that. And basically, there you go. you got a slicked-out black car. So if you do go on to enjoy this car, I know this is a very short video. Uh, be sure to leave a like if you like it, and uh, leave me some car suggestions below, and I'll try to make them. And with that being said, guys, I'm Avasai, signing out. 